See guys, look, come over here, come over here. Look look over here. See, this is Chad the uh <laughs> This is Chad the uh plane. So obviously, this is why you don't want to piss the civvies off, okay? Because he could take off. See, and he's going to literally do a flyby right now and go, there's, Bert, there's, Bert. Hold on, JJ, is JJ the jet plane here? JJ the jet plane, yes. Ow. JJ the jet plane. Ow. Well, that didn't work. <laughs>
Flaps are one, two to ground. Be advised. Like, that was supposed to be AT just here. two squads, and I guess the two AT <laughs> men and them just decided to oh, kill oh, everything. Delta's oh, moving is still up. Flaps are one, two, security north. Three squads. Delta, Delta, hold security for the southwest. Sir 1 1 reporting contacts northeast. Ground Alpha's entirely deceased. We're back at spawn, ready for insert. Now it's going to be up to squad tactics. We got one squad right up right here. Tanks covering best it can. Holy fuck. Charlie is uh, reinserting. All of Charlie was down. The uh, majority of Bravo is also reinserting. AI settings at default. Reinserting already. You should have a medic. That it's at half. Surviving people. We burned to death in the vehicle, and uh, for. Where's ground out of all of this? Are they not up with them? Or they pull back. Where'd those uh, R and R Vicks go? They're here. Lots one twos pulling back closer to friendly infantry. I might get rid of some AT pieces, but hot fucking damn. Do you want Delta? Oh, Delta to ground. We want Delta to mount to the mirror again. Not gonna lie, that is something that... We've got fire. I don't know how to feel about this, because... That... Being that effective is definitely my fault. But at the same time... I'm like... That was just two RPG guys. Like... Normally, those RPG guys act like idiots and don't do anything. So I'm like... How... How the f like? Why did the AI decide to be that fucking effective this morning? I have no idea. So what's that got piecemealed? That medic up there is down. They're pulling security with what they can. We have pushed east right yeah. of the road right now. We have invited the Mark yourself on the map, Echo. So infantry are now waltz back in. That's the one to the ground. Still one contact in the tree line somewhere. Rocket just got fired right one here. One on the ground. We're still getting squads from the northeast. This is Echo Maka Echo. Medic's getting those two up. Kind of reminds me of an old 506 video I saw where everyone in the convoy except for like the last two Vicks got blown up due to AI just being AI. And now you're seeing, you know, what these guys can do for the remaining units. Now these 50 cows firing at that Kajman. What's that? Just got shot up. Suppressing that smoke. So now you're hearing the comms over 50. I mean, that was, I think, a really good kick in the nuts to start with to kind of get everyone's head sorted of how this can easily turn into a slog. And I hope to see that. Whatever happens, happens. Let's take a look back at spawn. I hope they put the uh, item back in the resupply box. Friendly's they are. Do not push beyond the road. And they're bringing uh, up the other drone. Southwest. We have munitions coming in. So they decide to take those Vicks in. And now that's their convoy. So Joey cannot cover you if you push too far into the forest. Alright, that group's coming up. I just heard cluster munitions get dropped on this position. Hot damn. Let's, uh, let's give them a warm welcome, shall we? I'm gonna go back and put another quad bike or two down. Over in uh, their spawn. So some goats even getting engaged. 
Aye, aye, aye. I lance one one. All right, I'm gonna start setting up the next lines of ambushes here. But holy fuck, that beginning. That climb. Keep pushing. Clear up point vertical. I did not mean for it to be that lethal, but aye, aye, aye. That was just the definition of brutality, I guess. So I'm just fitting a few guys in these rocks. Just a nasty start. Lancer 1-2 to the ground. Send it. Since tank is at the front, are we to take the back of the convoy now, or...? Nope, tank is just maneuvering to try and get out of the fog will start to uh, fade as the, the, the day kind of goes by. Hey, firm. Echo to ground. Send it. I was going to just disconnect it. We have no long range available at the moment. I'm on short range, so excuse any communication problems. That's okay, just keep pushing to point first and clear it out. But I like the uh, long-range communication we're hearing right now. These guys have Echo certainly stepped up. So even though there was that, like, fluster cluck in the beginning, Charlie Foxtrot, just quite simply a clusterfuck. They're picking up the pieces, and they are continuing on, and that's, that's exactly what you got to do in that situation. I mean, that's the only thing you really can do. Just keep it going. I'm gonna finish this one little garrison, then we'll take a look at where they are and how they're adjusting. But those points still need to be cleared out. Bravo to ground. Send it. I am back on site now. What are you on? So these guys have moved up, taking a few casualties. Good grenade throws. Probably down to three guys three right there, and they got three guys down that they're getting up. Jojo, his tanks, I call him Jojo, he's pushed up. Ruling's still up here. Hiding around. Outcast coming in super low with that drone. Now they're coming in, clearing this stuff. That 50 cal, the net's kind of fallen. Rich clearing on his own with his handgun. I'm going to teach him why that's a bad idea. It's one of my pet peeves is people clearing alone. You can hear him walking around. Now his buddy's coming up to help. goes Pyro. Mag dumping him with the pistol. All right. So I always get the, like, because the thought process is you get the first guy, so medic will eventually get him. But, you know, if you go on your own and you're that first guy that's gotten, you're kind of SOL. So that first position's been cleared. They'll have to keep going up here. Go into there. Possible UXO. It's because they cluster bomb that spot. Those were the uh, cluster shells we heard earlier. You see these trees slightly knocked over. It was a good call. I'm gonna excel time a little bit just to see if we can break this fog. Take the shot. There you go. Just staring at him. And instead of an ambush right there, I'm just gonna bring a uh, a patrol to go around this that Charlie, vector. Uh, we have found deployable mines we can use. Okay, we're not going to use mines though. We're clearing the route, not destroying it. I'm 
this is the last place so where I want to have prep have ambushes. Charge, set it on the box and GTFO. So if there was a cache right there, that'll take uh, they'll take care of. Good call in though, asking ground what they wanted done with that. Well they did it. Now they're getting it deaded. Fog's actually just got a little worse. I'm gonna put these two on rear security. Once you guys have cleared Point Versa, go ahead and head back to the convoy, get a quick resupply, and then you plus the tank are going to move towards Point Santa and clear that out. It's broad shore back in. 330 Northwest, tank advancing to assess it. Don't push without an infantry screen. Roger. What are these guys set up with? Please it's wait like AT and Bravo, they're checking drones. Delta and, or whoever, our clear team gets back. Roger. I'm gonna be mean and throw a technical up at him. Goats re, god damn it. But they have that uh, hostile drone right here. I'm having time again, pass a little quickly, trying to get rid of today's fog. What did I do where I uh, where they turn where I want them to turn? So you garrison them and then you place the squad leader first because if you move the squad leader, he might change his uh, vector to look at, and then, then all these guys will look in different directions. Oop. With that, that was my technical. Um, but we I just use garrison and then I'm able to place everything. But you gotta place the squad leader first, otherwise they still move to the squad leader because once you move them, yeah, they move around. And yeah, it's PVP because we do oh, have yeah, three, four players. And mod giving us up to 2D. Two to, two D can never be there free. Over there. But I again, both of you, thanks for all your mod work. Hope you keep enjoying the ops and uh, hope you get a kick out of this. Confirmed. It, it was a uh, cheap. Roger. There's one explosive charge going off in here. Mine's explosive data. I mean, it was just a guy that had mines. I hope they didn't keep the cash alive, otherwise it's going to be funny as hell. Apologies, wrong net. Yeah, so they also soak or bombed this. Yeah, they have drones, feel free to engage them. Where's the IFV? Oh yeah. If you have eyes on it, go ahead and shoot it. Got the wave on. Oh, the next drone you have is uh, south of us currently. Drone down. Nails down. them. Roger. Clear team. Your next objective is Point Santa to our west southwest. Go ahead and step off with the tank in support and move towards it. Hey, last call sign. Uh, that just shot down the drone. This is UAV operator. Do you know which direction that drone came from? No, uh, it was just hovering west. Uh, it was bearing two six uh, two seven six about a quick hell. Copy. Thank you. I'm scanning for another one. Vehicle coming in from the road north. So he's in the UAV or the that picker upper. So I gotta keep an eye on what he's bringing. But he looks like he brought this over, so he is able to make that thing work. Now, I gotta wonder, what are you engaging? Oh, he just took out this uh, technical. I don't know where it pushed up from. Probably I forgot to garrison one of the technicals in the AO, and it just got shot down. Alright, so meanwhile, I'm gonna clean up bodies. Bro, over the ground. Wait, one. 
Uh, we've uh, regrouped with the rest of the convoy. Can't our, believe Rilling really survived that. Is what's that got MG'd right Bravo. next to him? You're gonna move southwest to point seven. Now the uh, BTR is still and scanning the sky. We have artillery firing on it currently. Get to the red phase line and wait for splash before you continue. Cosman flying really close right above the players. If she's not careful, you might see one of these guys try to engage it. I'm hearing a 50 cal engage. That is this turret right here. He flew right in front of it. Now he's getting shot at. Broadshore's having some weird tech issues. And you have this squad coming in right to where Ruling is. I don't think they know Ruling's right there. Oh, I'm going to see if I can quickly hide myself. Charlie, ready to move out. Oh, this is beautiful. Charlie, go ahead and move. Ruling's hiding in this bush. He has a squad right on top of him. Echo. Holy Three. fuck. No way. Oh, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, we moving further off the road. Negative. One of them literally Bravo. walked past Bravo. them. Bravo. Holy shit! Point Delta for the oh, fifth nice. time oh, right and oh, clearing it. Oh, I thought he was gonna get away with it. You hear I hope his bargain orders because people can't understand them. But holy Bravo crap, that, that was beautiful. Line, waiting for Bravo. artillery to splash. Roger. Charlie, Echo, please move up. That was Bravo, absolutely beautiful. Right now, and you should be up there with them. Oh man, that was great. We have left band twelve at the moment. More already splashing on this town. For Echo, could you just take command of the squad, please? I already did. Thank you. And please change your squad name so it's you know actually useful. Didn't that. I'm hoping by the PM the fog clears up because this is starting to get a little ridiculous even for me. I have these guys set up. Sort of cluster bomb munition go off somewhere over here. Though it's very... Oh! They are using those cluster munitions a lot more now. I love it. Bravo, Charlie, Echo, push along red line to yourself and come in from the southeast. Tank, move with them. Try not to walk through the USO minefields. But use your judgment with the terrain. I'm gonna fast travel it up to one o'clock, and if the fog still doesn't clear, I don't know what to do. They're taking suppressed fire right now. Tank's just kind of looking. But if it gets caught alone, they're probably gonna drop AT on her. This tank is now a perfect target for AT. But I'm not sure if they're going to risk a shot because a T-100 would survive an RPG and possibly fire back. The fact it is still this foggy baffles me. Yeah, it would be a perfect target if anyone could see. I agree.
I'm hearing booms. What's going on? Last one, one, two, with no contact, flight to convoy. We got some tracers to the north. Also, this fog is getting pretty bad. We can barely see anywhere. We're gonna have to start rounding the enemy soon if this keeps up. This is high. The weather does not want to change. I'm gonna manual it, so stand by. Thank you. Yeah, like, that is ridiculous. That was the wrong direction. Say again? There we go. It's getting better. It got, like, completely foggy there for a moment, and then it's just backing out, so... Yeah, stand by. It's just, it went to full fog as if we're in the mountains, so it's just being weird as shit. Charlie's in point, Santo. Echo the ball. Thank you, God. That's the best I can do. Do be aware that's still gonna be foggy in some of the lower parts. That's fine. Like, holy fuck, the mangroves. Bravo to the Zeko. This is Bravo, go ahead. Is point center cleared yet, or are we still expecting enemies? This is Charlie. Point center was clear. Uh, we still have contact at point center, but uh, it is mostly clear at this point. Contact north and northwest from point center. So I'd love to do fog, but fog is annoying because the AI don't work with fog. This to them, there's no fog, yeah, and they just shoot. Do not run north, northwest because uh, of UXEs and mines. And it's annoying as hell. So that Vic just pulled ahead. Now it's firing at that guy. are they doing? But a little bit of fog in the low ground will be fine. Bravo to Suicidal Quillen. Be advised there are UXOs and mines in that direction. Try not to explode. He said it was for fun. He well, if you're for fun, get one of our vehicles killed, I'm gonna have to be a very unhappy camper. Yeah, I know. You know, one of our limited transport vehicles. Uh, note on that note, he just got shot in the fuel tank and there's no more fuel in it. That's a one-two to ground. Uh, Outcast is trying to AGM. Boy, maybe two clicks out. Amazing. Roger. Uh, destroy that vehicle then, so that the enemy can't use it, because they all have been super bad at Once point that is clear, go ahead and They're still back. engaging this with bullets. Uh, there we go, the tank got on it. And remount as best you can. So Outcast is checking where you mark that cache. If I see him start murking the spawn point, I'm going to have to change it.
But yeah, that town should be doable with that level of uh, fog. It's just this is a little concerning, but should be okay. And then the rest Point going to low clear. ground should be okay. It's Bravo negative. How's the base look right now? This is Charlie. We're getting hit by something heavy. And it's foggy. Cool. Contact report so, tonight. So air to the system. This is Echo. I think the fire was coming from the northwest to the west. Not sure as we can only see the explosions at the moment. Send some AI down to engage these guys and I'll send a group of four from behind. Man, an HE rocket in the heart of that would be super evil. This Charlie, there's only a sniper left in this area. Should we move out? Uh, move back. Hi, can you refuel the drone back at base? Uh, apparently, he can't find the refuel deck. Refuel decks are marked by the wrenches at the map. Wait, 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 wait! Sniper just took out squad lead in the middle of the, uh, in the middle of the group. Scatter, please. Alpha's got contact northeast of the first bit. That's what he was engaging. Yeah, so these guys are going to be causing havoc now. They need to leave that area or else they're going to continue to get harassed. Tootie, are you drunk? Echo ground, I suggest moving because the sniper's taking out uh, the sword at the moment. Yep, so good amount of smoke billow, so now they need to pull back. Coming from. Negative. We have higher area 360 around us. Lancer 1-2 to Alpha. Send it. Are you still taking fire from anywhere? There, here comes the HE. Something's like coming from the south for some reason. Hey, we can't do what I have contact here. And it's what's that, as expected. Hey, firm, that's one two moving rear. So having these guys get engaged. Devincer, who I think his JTAC is down. Oh, they frickin' AGM'd my little static there. Plants one two to ground, you can bear it on the front end. Bitch. That AA piece is down, isn't it? I thought I saw it. Yeah, it's heckin' bamboozled. Alright. Those guys are engaging the rear. I got these guys out in the open. They're taking out. And these guys are having a gunfight with the snipers. That's not smart. Now these guys, yep, they're literally... One of them's naked by a glitch. But yeah, you don't want to push them because they... They're kind of better than you. Don't mean to be mean, but... We have Tempestal and XT3, I believe he's tier 2 right now. Nope, he is still tier 3. We have Kalem, another T3. What's that? One of our T5s and ruling commander a T4. So, these guys know how to play Op 4 Aggressor in this community. There goes the tank getting hit because they've been here for way too long. What's that putting a shell on them? So they need to leave, and they need to leave now. Because my guys know how to play Op 4, and they can play it really fucking well. I believe... Well, well I didn't believe hard enough, I guess. Hey, 
Hey, so you know that AA thing? Yeah, I think we're gonna actually use it. I meant for this to be a showpiece, but... Yeah... It's getting really comfortable being in enemy territory. Echo, we're pulling northeast out of front center right now. Roger, has point center been cleared yet? I don't know, but we are the only squad left there and we're not staying there. Point center is clear. There's an airstrike back there. Roger, pull back from point center back to the road then. Point center was cleared when they Sorry, already shelled back. the hell out of it, in my point honest opinion. Clear. This is Bravo, we're moving back. This tank needs to be told to pull back. Because if she's kept alone right there, she's gonna get schwacked. Ground, this is high, do you copy? Hi, what's up? Don't mean to rush you, but you have about an hour and ten minutes left before I have to call Index. You know, I was just having that conversation with my guy. They need to pop smoke and pull back. Have that tank pull around and cover your six. Have Artie or Air engage whatever's around you. This is Bravo to ground. We are approaching uh, Point Goats Re, and uh, we'll be rejoining the convoy after. I mean, air is literally ready to do a gun run if you want it to. Taking contact on the road right now. Which road? <laughs> is he engaging friendly? The dirt road, uh, two point center. I think he's shooting at a body up here. From what direction? Unknown at the moment. I suggest. I uh, I suspect so be. Copy that, already doing that. Tempestle, I think, got that shot. He's pulling back. Kalem getting a little aggressive here. He's getting engaged by the tank. So it's left plate, that's where what's that hit it. And you got the Cosman right here. I bet he's scanning. I just saw some shots. She's gonna pull back instead. Go ahead and get mounted back up in whatever vehicle you can find. Uh, try and form a semblance of the convoy order again. So far, so good. Uh, the enemies don't have mortars. These guys do have artillery, but instead of a mortar, they're using a Socor. Which is this puppy. And they brought the ammo, Vic, so they could constantly shell. Cack. We found the white, uh, white van over here. Uh, are we clear to use it as transport? No, there should still be vehicles back here that you can use. Now you have Kalem with a suppressed AK. Shooting at these guys. Lucky needs to uh, need extra capacity. try to displace. Charlie's, you uh, can even see him on thermal. Standing a little ahead of you guys and uh, keeping enemies out. That support needs to come in. Has capacity as well. They need to be using that artillery to be a bit more defensive. We got the turret right here shooting at the... Uh, Charlie, where are you going? The Vic. Hazard time getting Charlie's hit. Currently static on the position of mark. Yep, your orders were to fall back to the convoy position and remount. Rapman, be advised, um, this has been engaged by SD. Yeah, Alpha Vic just has one of its vehicles, or sorry, tires flattened. Look at this, Charlie, we'll move back. Now they're suppressing. This is, this would be a really good time to call an artillery or air support on that position. Because they're going to be a lot more effective than these guys with their bullets. 
Now you have another air asset. She's got a 20 millimeter cannon. I think she's deploying reinserts actually. Yep, so there's a guy in there. He gets out. That's Bogan. Charlie's currently getting in engaged from uh, the west. Ground, this is Hyde. You copy? What's up? So, uh, I'm reading this magazine. It has a really good uh, tip in here for jungle combat. Maybe instead of having squads try to get in a gunfight with Sniper, have uh, your squad coordinate where that marksman is and have Air or Artie shoot at their position instead of the guys with guns. Over. You know, I was reading that same magazine yesterday too. Yeah, it helps if the squad knows where the marksman is coming from and doesn't just freak out when they get shot at, but, you know, whatever. No, that's true. I mean, it also says here sometimes saturated fire of every possible position is also best, since, since you have the ammo for it. Yeah, it also says the squad shouldn't run off on their own and do their own thing, but... Yeah. Hey, <laughs> guys, guys, uh -oh. I'd like to say something. <laughs> Delta. Delta 2. Ladies, you're both pretty. That's my line, damn it! There are six. Can you not get it? We can. I just wanted to know. There's an entire Metis Quillen back here. Well, I'm uh, supposed to take as few vehicles as possible or as much vehicles as possible. I don't know where Clueless is running off to. Vehicles at this point. I don't care. We just need to get moving. We've spent an hour on these first two objectives. Get in the VIC. Player base is back. doing let's okay. Let's get going. Mr. Bravo, we're ready to move. Hey, good mom, is that ready to move? Delta's ready. Delta's ready. We start. But yeah. Aw, oh, I missed. Oh, there goes my Hail Mary. Everyone else, let's start rolling. Hey, fam. I'll just join up once he passes by. Let's not leave this squad behind. We're not. They have a quillin for them. Jesus Christ, start listening, please. <laughs> What's that saying? Do I want to know? <laughs> no! Wait! This guy is 18! He's stuck in the corner! Uh oh. Also, contact you right in the town. One guy, apparently. To blow up the fucking building and drive past it. See, and then you have this AT guy that's like, oh, cool! Like, why don't you AT him? Because I know you have the ammo for it. Oh, no, too late. You're dead. Hey, for our alpha, we should probably pull back. a lot of their pan guns today. I'm actually surprised on that. Why did we stop? Why did we stop? We got engaged by uh, infantry inside the buildings. No one called the convoy stop. Where's the IFP? IFP is up on the convoy. We kept going, we paused to let everyone catch up. We're just down the road with Alpha. Charlie joined up with the convoy. These guys are getting super close. This building I forgot to garrison, but with how air schwacked it already, it's not needed. And you have these poor stragglers running by. <laughs> Why are you still getting out of the thing? 
Get in and let's go. So I guess they're gonna skip Point Royal. I'm breaking those guys apart and setting them up. Still got an AA piece right there. Now they're shooting at the infantry. Uh-oh! Whoo! Mr. AI Convoy, get moving. puts Purple his RPG on ended. his back as he is feeling merciful. Decides to go Perfect. slow. Not help. It only makes it work. He's gonna peek the corner. The road front. But the player Convoy base is already ditching. Moving. Contact dead ahead of us. We're engaging. And volcanoes run up with the. Ch <laughs> I have been pushing slowly. Tank, enemy vehicle, push the pot, dead. Kalem's found one of their drones, and I guess he shot the shit out of it. Volcano's just chilling one, in one. here. Do you see the white fan at your one o'clock? Break this Bravo white van behind the convoy is friendly. Do not fire. One of my lads grabbed it. Oh my god. Crash I know. Down. You literally just give everyone a heart attack. Please stop this stupidity. Push through contact. Shoot and That's move. a laser. I think that's Outcast trying to sight a target. Infantry contacts are down, we're pushing past the board by the location now. Now we have right past this or halt? You have GMGs and HMGs, shoot them. I just heard something explode. Alpha Victor's lost engine. That was a drone. Falling off. Roger, herringbone at Alpha Victor's position. Driver just got yeah, shot out of that deck. Just took heavy fire. Just Charlie, drive it down. Is he out of ammo? I bet he's out of ammo. Attackers on fuel truck ended. Alpha's gonna load up in front of ISB. ISB, get prepared quickly. An MG gun still alive. I think it doesn't need repair. I was told I think has their engine out. Oh, Negative, no, Alpha Vic. Like... The Marid behind us. I mean, ammo would be nice. I don't know if you could come out of but Thank you for the. Yeah, we have ammo. Oh, I like them. Go get the ammo, Vic. Uh, go clear team. Go ahead and push back and clear point Zeus. Hey, I'm Charlie moving back to attack uh, point Zeus. All right, I need to start garrisoning my later points, so give me a second, guys. <laughs> Buy that 50 cal. And they just got him, but he's still up. And he's down. No, he's still alive. There he goes. He's got quite a few kills there. 
So even though they knew that was there, because Air Outcast marked that before we even started the operation, still got a few kills. So I'm going to delete that turret. I'm going to keep these Vix, delete these bodies. Delete those bodies, delete that weather effect. This is Jtech 2 I Opus. I'm down. So uh, just throw red smokes where you want to catch them to him. Where are you down? These guys are all repositioning. Do we have an engineer that can repair the infant engine? We have a repair. So they got this position cleared out now. Probably so Rick finding that the ladder doesn't lead to uh, Deuce, Deuce where he wants clear. to go. Thank you. Go ahead and get back up here and start pushing up towards So they've cleared the more in the last 10 okay, minutes yeah, than they have the past move. hour getting stuck on, on that pause. So I'm going to move their spawn. Here. This is Echo we want to back up again. This is just moving the op for aggressor spawn. So I still got a You're reference point rearm. holo later, but this is Charlie. Uh, we do not have any more vehicles down in our main base to get the reinsert for. Looks uh, like that Kajma was finally LD shot down. Have been flying them over as they went. Are they out of Vix? No, they still got some Marids and a Kamish. Hey, fam. They lost one of the Kajmen, because I think she got shot down by that AA. And other drones being deployed. Lancer 1 2 is rearmed. We're going to pull up to the white. Ruling hide in a there. bush. Roger, infantry start pushing up the way. Whew. To our northwest of the dirt road at the radio tower. Hey, thief got out of basic training. IRL, right? <laughs> I think I recall you talking about it. Hope it went all right, man. Hope you didn't get your ass kicked too, too hard. Thanks for the hundred bits, man. Hope you keep enjoying things. Look at the what's what's that's pushed up. Let's see what he's looking at. Oh, he's looking at that Quellen. That's a good target. So, our sight line isn't going to be exact. It looks like he is adjusting a little more. Oh, it stopped. It's going to go for that headshot. Let's see it. A little over. He's shooting at the infantry in front. He's trying to sight his targets effectively. Manford got run over. Looks like Gunner and Shotgunner also got hit right there. Smoke being popped, good call. Volcano also getting shot. Another smoke being popped, really, really good to see that. But needs to be called in over 50. No one's dead. Squad leader hey, needs to say, hey, we're getting MG, shot at. Instead of slowly pushing up in Vix and getting shot to shit by one MG, how about you dismount, spread out, and actually push and scream the Vix like you're supposed to. Now this cam is coming in. No, there's additional aircraft coming in as well. So they just smoked one of my Nixes back here, and they smoked this other Nix over here. Fuck's sake. And my tractor! Damn it! I like that tractor! It was just a civilian tractor! <laughs> so what's that feeling? Really confident in that position. He's gonna keep engaging. Echo interrogative. Uh, why are we holding? I'm waiting for infantry to push up! How fucking okay, hard is Okay, then. This? Echo's pushing northwest now. Good, bravo. Charlie, push up to point midway today, please. It's like a miscommunication where they didn't know what uh, infantry was supposed to do. Tank shooting at these bodies, making sure they're dead. This is bravo, we are moving. 
Lancer? Lancer is online, yes. Go, start moving. Infantry first, Lancer forward. That's how this works. Not the other way. So I wonder if aircraft are gonna land back here. One, one, Once that, we'll have a shot on some reinserts. North down the road. One, two, we'll push with infantry. Hey, firm. One, two's pushing. Look at that. One, one's holding. And he is just sniping those medics. Charlie, you're pushing the wrong Hits way. the other medic. Alpha's covering the tank. All right, come on. If you smoked your south, and now that your south is no longer smoked, and you're getting shot at, you can assume that he's to the south, right? Should a rocket get launched? That might have been my triple A. No, it was not. Hmm. Ground, looks like we just lost our attack chopper. Yep, I see that. Cack, it was this guy. Yep. So yeah, that cash marker. Echo to ground, we reached the base of the uh, tower. JR Echo to Charlie, if you could hurry up a little bit, we'd like to push uh, up fast in here because guys are running grenade. Echo to Charlie. Good, and they're killing my secret boys. Echo's pushing in. Waiting to see if what's that? He's gonna crawl up there and take some more shots because they're just chilling right there. Ruling's pulled along the rear. You have Kalem right there. TF003 artillery incoming. Keep your heads low and stop keeping the sniper with your faces. I don't know where DF003 is. Get behind something hard and stay there. He has advantage on you. You can't fight him fast enough. Oh! <laughs> There's that 20 millimeter cannon firing. Lancer 1, 2 to infantry, be advised. If you throw smoke directly in front of us, we can't help you. I got smoked by that guy. that shot normally if you see a buddy go down you want to kind of go at the uh, different angle because if you just poke at a corner he's holding it's gonna be a little tougher that landed right at your feet buddy Dun, 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 dun. Ah, someone did the smart thing, and while, uh, yep, JW, uh, JR, the guy that I TP, does the smart thing. Once that gets killed, today. they found that sniper. Good. Now I got a patrol down here, and it is gonna look for blood. That's what I'm around. Now they're firing back One and forth. Squads have a here already. Will we pull back to the convoy? Uh, yeah, pull back to the convoy. We're still taking sniper fire from our southwest. Hey, firm, we're going back. Can do some body deleting. This is actually just to confirm we're pulling back. So we definitely compared to last week, a lot better tactics used. Are there still some mistakes? Yes, but it's so much better than what I thought would happen. Especially after that punishing beginning. So they're doing okay. 
Time wise, I got about 40 minutes left, but they're they're making good time. So I'm gonna go on point holo now and I'm gonna garrison her up now that we have a little bit of a break. Alpha, Start with the squad Delta, lead. Mount up these bags as best you can and push them down the road into the town. I don't care about the unarmed Skrillin, but I care about the one with the Metis on it at the very least. Lancer went to the ground. Do you want us to leave the convoy down? So Not even going to fill the, uh, the pillboxes. Do you want Lancer 1-2 to leave the convoy down? Or the tank? Yes, please. 1-2. Hey, firm. Infantry should be pushing down as well, so... Alpha's pushing. So I'm throwing down fast garrisons here because of the amount of time we have left. This is Echo B advised beginning engage from the northwest, Thunder Hill northeast of the uh, point of midway. You guys are assaulting into this ambush like I figured they would. Roger, could you put out a rough mark of where they are? Looks like JR unfortunately dies up on that position. Oh, Thought I just saw AT get pulled out, but no, that was just the machine gunner. Uh oh. Here it comes! You, you, wow, okay. Do it again. He's not even moving! One, two, I don't want three to for three! To there it is. Wow, he survived! He did half damage. Yeah, now there's friendlies up here too, so they're engaging each other. You want to move forward? Yeah, so my ambush right up here is mostly down, Keck. Delta to convoy. And everyone in there is dead. What do we can hold? Quantas is echo is working contact heading east to the convoy right now. One two, Alpha is gonna push back. Hey, firm. One two will follow you. Mr. Bravo, we are at the gas station west of town, engaging hostiles. Hey, firm. Delta, start moving your pick forward. Move this convoy forward. Right. One, two, let's wait to head off the convoy again. Alright, let's see what I can see from up here. Echo to ground, we're mount mounting up again? No, just push along the road. I'm waiting for the Delta and Marit to figure out to find his W button. Thank Stop. you. You are literally- Owie. Of course I'm dead. Did you miss the part where I told you to move forward? My bad, dead. One, two is pushing slowly up. We'll speed up when everyone's fit reached us. Don't know why that other half isn't falling. Probably because they were spawning Just something. Just pushing on foot with these Vicks. Here, uh, they dropped an airstrike Lancer on that position. One, two, just try and keep pace with uh, the Vicks, or with the infantry. Hey, firm, slowing down. Lancer 1 2 to the ground. If we're sticking at infantry speed, should we kick out our passengers? If you have extra infantry passengers that should be doing their job, then yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah, so I didn't get that position garrison because meant a lot of stuff going on. Contact southwest on one two. Push him. Well, I don't want to push him on that open hill phase, but I guess we'll work with what we got. Two, 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 two. Yeah, so far the player base has been adapting. So it's been good to see. I did not call a herringbone. Get back on the road and keep moving. So there's ruling. What's that, Calum? There's a reason we have infantry squad left. alongside us. Keep moving. You have auto cannon. You have HMGs. You have CMGs. Please use them. Hey, Mr. AT, you gonna use that? No? Okay. Yeah, now the AI doesn't want to AT anything. It's so funny. That's fair, Shadow. I, I mean, frames have been good all up, at least from what I can see, so I guess it's just your computer. West, or west of the open. There's AT five, finally coming five, in. Eight. Looks like that wasn't from that guy, though. Tacky West. Monster 1 2 is engaging. Hmm. That A is really nasty. I'll oh, for it, just ran out of ammo. Decky's dead. Keep pushing on the northwest. Alpha Ifrit, pull off to the left side of the road and wait for the ammo bit to catch up to you. Alright, let's see. Car. Car by the side of the air above the conflict. Echo to ground. This ground footed, uh, ground mobile, uh, convoy moving too fast. Slow it down, people. Yeah, I just wanted to say, uh, the tank just left us behind right now. They're firing at the drone, and they get him! Re-enter to air. Master 1-2 is contact west. Enter 1-1, one, one, contact south. There goes that one. Second RPG, and there it is. Infantry, push west. There's that's an enemy tank away in front of us. Oh, they were both LMGs. Huh. So lead Vex are down because they pulled way Infantry, ahead. Push up. Get in front of these Vex. Oh, your brother's downloading something, taking all your speed away. Yeah, that would do it. Free bus. So both of their IFVs were way ahead of the infantry and just got schwacked immediately. They got a few kills off the ambush, but even then... Was a tad messy. Does the uh, tank want to go in front, or you we're want attempting to, but infantry keep walking in front of us? I'm gonna go ahead and delete those groups. What's the point, Wolf? And clear that out, please. Tank is now pushing ahead. This is Echo. We're heading southwest, but not the point. Wolf clearing up. Yeah, what's that in ruling our trailing behind? And these guys kind of follow up the rear. Echo, Delta, push to point wolf. Charlie, Bravo, push into that red box and clear it out. Alpha, two to six. Hey, firm. 
Ground, this is high. Uh, based off of time, I want you to disregard point holo at this time. Over. Yes, sir. Another rocket coming in. If you wish. Another RPG coming along that tank. It held position and now she's getting blastoed. There was another hit. She needs to pull back, get R and R. One more rocket might. And they get him with HE. Couple of more guys. Reinserts being deployed. Delta's waiting for one of our guys to uh, never go. Don't wait for Charlie, one guy. Charlie, 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 Copy that, that doesn't help us much, but okay. Not sure if Friendly's just got cluster bombed. Uh, it might be up at Point Holo. Delta's moving with their mirrored into the uh, point now. Hey! This is Echo. Why were, uh, why were we not informed that Point Wolf is completely filled with UXOs? Yeah, what up? It's uh, literally circled with the black and given a UXO warning. Um, it's not a convoy objective. I would you give it nine minutes, and if they're still here, blow them up, okay? Because they're almost done. Yeah, I mean, that one just got hit, so. Yeah, so these guys stepped on a UXO because they cluster bombed that area. And there goes another one. Echo Delta. Delta. Could we get a medic to our position, please? We are 50 meters uh, northwest of Point Wolf. They did, uh, if they wanted that hit, they should have used regular ammunition, not, Charlie, not UXOs. Follow. Are you going to start clearing that red area, specifically the mountain where all the dudes are coming out of, or are you just going to sit there? This is Bravo. Just We're a... already on site and clearing it. Cool. Well, we just lost the repair Vic, so... Ouch. trying to hit that. Oh, that was my AA dude. Blaster 1-1, one, one. are you engaging something? No, oh, no we are not. I also think you spot a sniper to the west, we're firing at it now. Yeah, that sniper was my, I uh... I hearing tank shells for ourselves back behind us. That was my one AA dude. I had an AA static back there and they kept flying over. Swap heading to south. Thank you for the report. That's okay. quicker to do Jump than me just, south. yeah. Booping that over. These guys have been medic'd up. 
Drop the ground. Red box is clear. Tank is pulling that. What's that? Trying to adjust. This is Jetpack Lance 1 1. You might want to back up a little. I don't know why he's saying things, Lyria. Lance 1 1 has lost its track. This is Charlie. Asking to get the area called Nuke Nuke with the UXO. Run the way back into the AO with three reinserts. Ground, we're going to need a medic up here in the white building. We're getting uh, accurate fire from somewhere we can't see. This is Charlie calling heavy rain. Alpha medic's down. Charlie, where do you want it? Under position called nu Nuke on map. So, what's that got hit? He's bandaging. Okay. We weren't supposed to point, point follow, but I guess people are doing it anyway, so. DJ's in the air. It was just shooting at us, that's why, when we were in the box. There's a JTAG rounds already on the way. Roger, Charlie, pull back. Pop smoke and disengage. I was kind of curious to see how many reinserts need to be deployed. Let me also delete this squad of infantry because it's not needed anymore. Charlie, moving back to the convoy. You guys in there. Doing another cluster bomb right here. Has to be a UXO or two left. Echo, what's your status? Delta's just picked up Echo. Uh, I assume we're gonna check the point now. Get my no, mic. Just pull back. Pull back. Yep, just pull back. And here comes what's that being the sniper. This is Bravo, we've finished playing the red box and have regrouped with the convoy at this time. Roger that. Woo! Caleb just got cluster bombed! Okay, which direction are you gonna pull back to? From I think they were trying to kill that sniper up there more than anything. Uh, this is JTEX Charlie, uh, area nuked is nuked. Green are op four aggressors, yep. There were four of them, one of them rage quit. I let what's that pick a few guys because Iopis, uh, he wanted hard mode. So far, the points, I told them to pull off of Holo, so they just dropped a bunch of ordnance on it. Looks like they came in, but it wasn't clear, and yeah, they got oofed right there. That's a big ouch. Hey, 1-1, one, one, can you send one of your engineers back to the fuel truck and see if they can give it a look-see? Lancer 1-2 to ground Roger. you guys. Yeah, there's an no enemy HP left. Us and you, we're dead again. You know, it's almost like they should really tow them in, you know, like, and then drop them by the friendlies. It was a convoy op, Iceberg. It definitely was. We're getting shot at from southeast to south. I'm gonna ask in debrief, and I'm gonna pool everybody, should we turn this into a 40 man or keep it 60 man? Because I think less people to have to coordinate will make this easier. So Alpha Bravo, Charlie, Delta, and then that's gonna be Charlie, 32 slots. Taken down by uh, enemy sniper. And then 
that will leave, you know, plus my Zeus plot, plus ground command, that's 34, so six slots where they can do whatever they want. So they can have vehicle crews, they can have pilots, they can have spare medics, they can have AA, already. Ground, we're still getting hit by sniper fire up here by the White House. Bravo to ground, uh, sniper, I believe, is somewhere in the yellow circle. Ground, this is high. You got about 20 mics before I'm gonna call him next. Hey guys, man. And this is Jay. Sorry, I'm uh, I, I, I think I disagree. I think less people in scaling it down is, uh, would definitely be, be helpful. All right. Copy that. Uh, I can have a rocket, but I don't. I don't think people are clear from there. It should Delta's be clear. Just south of the uh, yellow circle. Because, I'm going to be honest, I have not had more than, I want to say, three squads engaging people at once. It's just been sporadic enemy. Shooting at that guy. Mount up your near pick, and if you don't have space, they can walk. Let's get going. That might have been the AA launcher. I think it fell off the cliff. Yeah, Rock. Uh, yes and no. It depends on the community. TSB has only a handful of people that'll step up to lead, and it's because we put them in situations like these where, you know, people are going to go off and do their own thing. That's a given. So it's kind of just working with what you have available to you. We're moving up along the road. Roger. Stop worrying about the sniper and start moving. So I got that one guy. One good thing though they did is air immediately blew up some of my nexes one, I had one, in ambush spots. One one copy. Was one one needing? One one is now lead pick. Thank you. Alpha, I mean, if you just look at the amount of bodies spot. we have here, it's only like about ten. Yeah, the rest of them walk. Another eight to ten, so oh, yeah, about three squads worth. Uh, Bravo to convoy. Be advised, this is ahead. just two it's squads right here and uh, a Nix. Maybe hundred meter good visibility. Let's play spooky. Set contact for northwest. Just dead, but shooting it. There goes that tank. as a lift symbol. And so you can barely make them out, but they're there. We're coming back. 
for the actual time this time. Be asserting. Roger, 1-1 one, one just ate an RTG because they took shots and didn't bother to turn their home. Hey, firm, there's no more vehicles left at the staging point. They'll need one from the airfield. He's got shot in the head. Just echo squad, get back on that with the child bench. Charlie's down ahead of uh, Lancer. Two spare medics. Pops a frag over. Another frag. This is their level of visibility. He's just right here. Other people see him. I'm a Nix. Bye, Fred. Good to meet you. This Bravo, we are doing the same. Lancer, once you just passed point power. enough 12.7 into something that's not a tank eventually it'll probably maybe dismount I don't know and they cluster bomb this <laughs> Lancer 1-2 is back with the group where do you want us to go up the dirt road to the north to the exit point thank you this is angry, but the HMG is can't kill next you just gotta hit in the right areas to kill the crew or the engine block. Bravo, we are also approaching the point. That's something Tanks DLC added in. I think what's that trying to line up a shot in the driver's seat? Don't Bravo to ground. Ferry area is clear. Roger that. A delta to any engineer. I need a fire uh, bed. This is echo. We've oh, now they're just showing off. Lancer 1-2 has reached exit mark. Why are they fucking around that next? Hi, 
this is grand. This is high, it's on traffic. 203 supply trucks have reached the point plus, I don't know, 30 of us. Hey, firm. Once all of you get to the index point, I will go ahead and index. Delta Vic. Delta Vic at Pine. Right now we've got a destroyed, two destroyed wheels. Coming up now. Roger, if it's faster to you, for you to walk, do so. Delta's coming to that point now. On foot. We will have another op in 40 minutes, so... Alright, this is high, gonna go ahead and end next. Index incoming, no shooting. Junior Wits shot at index there. Uh, that's fine. Okay. It's because all the other casual communities kind of have that happen, and we should be stating that in the beginning of the up, not the end, because having some of these people expect to read is kind of so difficult. Oh, there we go. go. Following orders was apparently a lot harder today than it should have been, but... It was there. still better than last week, which is all I care about. So, uh, Iopus, I understand you have an op to go prep, so Iopus, I'm going to let you speak on Ground Command's POV first, uh, then I'm going to take a quick poll, and then we'll continue on with uh, debrief. Uh, you've got time. We pushed that slot back to 7.30. 7.30, okay. So, uh, before we get into anything, I want to take a quick poll here. Uh, I just want to make sure that... All right, Alpha and Bravo. I'm going to quickly set Bravo to unlimited standby. Oh, I can't do that. CAC. All right, we'll do it this way. Um, Echo's unlimited. Okay, Echo's unlimited. Cool. So um, I'm going to leave two options here. Uh, go to Alpha Squad if you want to continue doing ops like these. Go to Echo Squad if you want to do something else. Because at the end of the day, these are for you. So I want to see who picks what because I want to. You're the main player base, and I want to see what people decide to choose. Oh, to find what do you mind else. with? What do you mean with something these? easier? And what is something that's thing? general warfare. Okay, I think that uh, kind of, yeah, that proves a point. All right, hold here. Empires. All right, jump back up. Jump, jump back up. Jump back up. Anything. All right, we're going to uh, keep doing this style of operation now. Uh, second and final vote, I'll do. Go to Alpha if you want to keep it at 60 people, or go to Echo if you want us to try doing it with 40 people. It would be Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, and then six slots of Air or Vic Crew or whatever. Uh, reserving two for Zeus and Ground Command. So it's Alpha for keeping it at 60? Yep. I mean, I yeah, that's pretty cut and dry. All right, hold here, hold here. All right, jump back up. Yeah. Jump back up. All right, we're gonna we're gonna keep it the way it is then. Um, overall today, definitely an improvement from last week. Uh, last week was pretty fucked up. Uh, would I consider today to be better than two weeks ago though? I would say yes, with the exception of the um, close to the end. Um, there was a bit of a falter and squads went everywhere. So a couple pointers I want to give. Number one, if you intend on clearing an enemy position with infantry, do not use cluster munitions on it. Uh, because if there's UXOs, your infantry might step on it. And that's exactly what happened at Point Wolf. Clearing it with HE shells or something and just blanketing that area would have been a much better idea. 
Uh, but on a side note, really good job with the ordinance today. Uh, I think we've had more ordinance used today than the other three missions combined. And that really did help you out in thinning out my numbers and the ambushes and uh, keeping things going. I want to give a slight apology to the beginning. Um, I don't know why, but the two AT guys I had in the two squads that were going to ambush you decided to go full on JoJo and kill four of your APCs within 30 <laughs> seconds. Uh, my AT guys then proceeded for the rest of the op to miss three shots point blank before maybe hitting one of your Vicks, so I don't know. Uh, it's just Arma AI for you. I felt a little bad in the beginning, but I think that was a good proper ass kicking, because after that you guys got your shit together and pretty much kicked uh, most of that AO's ass with the exception of the end when it got a little messy, especially with the fog settings. Um, I tried my best to make sure everything was balanced. At most, you were attacked by up to three, maybe four squads at a time. That only happened once. Everything else was either you got there and it was dead, or you blew through contact and it kind of enveloped you, or it was the Op 4 aggressors shooting at you. Um, if you find yourself in a position where you're getting shot at by snipers, guys, just smoke it. That was also done a lot of times, really good job, but make sure you let ground command know you're getting engaged and try to give them a position. If there's no position, just try to work out where the sniper may be. Uh, there were a few times where when you guys just guessed, you were right. And even then, if you were Ron, well, and you still get fired at, then you know it's not there, it's going to be somewhere else. Uh, you were able to kill a few Op 4 aggressors by utilizing that method. So I would say... Tactics today were very, very good, despite it being a bit messy. So, keep it up. Next stop will be uh, next week. I've got an interesting one prepped, but we'll see how things go. Ground Command, go ahead. Um, so, uh, organization started out great. Uh, convoy order was okay. Uh, the AT at the beginning did kind of throw me for a loop lost two and a half squads out of that um uh we spent almost an hour in the first two objectives i don't know what was going on with people not listening on 50 or not hearing me on 50 or just generally not moving um but it was a little frustrating to have to repeat myself four or five times just to get people to move forward. And it's unfortunate. But I'd like to think everyone else had fun, so odd man out today. All right, Alpha? Alpha did pretty good on defense. We, I mean, after the first time we did good, we just kind of blew up and reinserted. And we didn't lose our Vic a second time, which I really wanted to make sure. After that, uh, thanks to 1-2 for cooperating with the defense while you were alive. And thanks to my gunner for shooting everywhere that we thought a sniper was. <laughs> That's all. Bravo. All right, I'd just like to start us off by apologizing to Ground. We, I was having some TFAR issues where it would eat, like, every other message I'd attempt to send to you. I will look into that and see if I can get that fully fixed. Uh, other than that, I think Bravo Squad was doing really well. I was very proud of you guys. And other than the big oof at the start from the JoJo AT, I think we did okay. Next one. Uh, Charlie was pretty good. Uh, good team. Good work. Uh, we tried to follow uh, ground command, uh, commands, but sometimes you just got drawn on all the noise. But anyway, we tried our best and yeah, got hacked down a lot by enemies, but still good. Delta. All right, guys. I first want to apologize to. Uh, ground command for uh, my lack of comms a bit and to echo which i was driving around i was a bit confused as well because i was trying to deal with the comms and this is the first time i was a uh, squad leading but we, i think we had a bit of fun at least my squad did and our vehicle survived until the end so that's all i have to say echo yeah i took over uh, fico squad lead 
after the first like 15 minutes because I don't know what was going on if you couldn't use the radio. Anyways, um, yeah, Echo did pretty good. We up, uh. Oh, fuck, I'm done for the day, sorry. I don't know, I... Um... Yeah, the UXO thing was a bit unfortunate, but that was my fault, I didn't read the map properly. And in in general, the comms on 50 were bad today, like really bad. But in the squad comms were okay, and we did good at the end. That's it. Alright, JTAC? Um, JTAC, uh was doing air and rd today most of the strikes that were done were ordered by me uh thank you iopus for letting letting me the jtag just do that at my own discretion like you say oh can you please hit this and i'll be like okay and i'll just hit it with whatever i deemed appropriate which was good for to make it not complicated um air you uh were really Good today, sorry if I didn't always respond immediately. I also had half an hour on 50, which sometimes drowned out your comms. Uh, I want to do, I want to make a special mention of the Nephron cluster uh, pilot that dropped a cluster bomb behind us and didn't, did not hit any of them. Very good job. Exactly what I wanted. Thank you. And uh, yeah. Uh, thank you, uh, Fabit, for manning the SOCOR, a mostly boring job, but uh, you were very good utilized today, uh, I've been told. That's all. Alright, uh, Knight 1. Or Lancer 1, excuse me. Yeah, um, honestly, we pulled rear guard for a lot of it till Lancer 2 died, and then we pulled forward guard. Well, and ended up getting killed while everybody was paying attention, screening front when we got and we got sh APT'd to the end. Honestly, we sh moved around, we shot, kept seeing people get sniped out, couldn't do anything about it. Had a good time. Eight five AT shells to the face, but didn't it did nothing to our tanks because we're badasses. And then one to the rear blew us up. Yeah, welcome to our side. That's how that works. Weak substance. You were held together by bubblegum. Uh, Lancer 2. Uh, not much to say. We did what the convoy did. Infantry screens were non existent to pretty bad, but other than that, didn't go too bad. Air assets. Sledgy. Manura. Zan was not my fault. Uh, just a small thing, when I took on the Nephron, there was a, a drone taken off at the same moment. I'm not sure if the UAV controller was on the same net, but I almost ran so, into it. The thing is, is I only have one short range radio and I can't listen in and call in to the airfield that a drone is taking off. So I was trying to tell the Vincer or whoever was JTAC that, hey, drone's coming in for landing. Uh, drones coming to take off, and I was hoping that he would also tell me when someone was coming in to land and when someone else was going to come in to take off because I wasn't able to communicate that over 5 5. Yeah. Um, when in doubt in a situation like that, give right of way to the drone because usually if I'm on the drone, I'm controlling it for takeoff and landing just to be there, but sometimes <laughs> you can't. So you, as the pilot in the jet or helicopter, just give right of way to the drone and be safe. Yeah, no and problem. I did try to get that off a of runway as fast as possible because I did. I was controlling it. I had just controlled now. it as you just flew mm -hmm. overhead, or no, not flew overhead. Flew next to me, uh, taxied next to me, and so I tried getting out of your way, and then you stopped to try getting out of my way. So there was that whole confusion there. So apologies on that, but like I, I didn't have much control. Pyro, and I was trying to communicate thank you it for to the, the four best months of my ability. Resub. I know you've been here a long time. With what I had to join the ops, man. Yeah, no problem. Kick out of this. We got another op in an hour and a half. All right, so a few quick notes, um, things that just came to my attention. Number one, uh, Outcast, do you think I should just add an LR to your kit? Would that make it easier? I don't know how you'd be able to accomplish that and have a darter drone, because the darter drone was also super useful. Uh, I can just put one at base. Yeah, that 
that would also that would probably be a good idea because yeah. in reality i think the uav should also be on five five as well yeah all right i'll do that oh, uh, uh number two this mirror? is more of um a general thing guys uh, yeah. um what's that is the only guy allowed to be on the stream and in ops at the same time don't freak out if he's on both i he's a five i trust him enough to you know not use metagame knowledge he's more there as an administrator so you don't uh, or was i pushing you intel today from the stream Caleb. Wasn't it a fact? I trust him not to do that shit, and if he does, he knows that we're him and I are gonna have a talk. But who was trying to get my attention? Uh, uh, Davinson. Yeah, what? The JTAC laser dash does not have a battery and can't laze. Oh That's yeah, he was having he couldn't laze because he didn't have a battery and his laser does. That's weird because I know I have one in this kit, but I'll check it again. For the um, true operator in the past, you were able to make it so that way he would be the only person to have a select inventory item available to him from the arsenal. Yeah. You could try that. Yeah, I'll, I'll experiment this week since we're sticking with this. Um, Artie. Oh, yeah. Hold up, let's let Artie speak and then we'll get to up for. Uh, <clears throat> Artie had fun. Um, I should have been a bit more proactive, insisting to use HE over cluster munitions, because especially on actual objectives. Um, something else I would have liked to do is have more smoke screens for when our VICs are all fucked up, and we need to get shooters back up. Uh, as well as when we started taking sniper fire, there was like a lot of insistence by the JTAC. No offense. Uh, but uh, it would go from, all right, so core, saturate this area, to no, hold off, and then nothing. And the whole time I'm listening on 50, hearing our guys talk about this sniper that's fucking them up. Um, other than that, uh, it was a pretty fun op for me, even though I was sitting in the back just supporting you guys. All right, uh, not four. Uh, don't push your vehicles ahead without infantry screen, because then they get shot by anti-tank, and you don't have any more vehicles left. Um, we did mostly a lot of reconnaissance via drone, and then just uh, audio and visual. Like uh, we had almost no line of sight today we couldn't see anything beyond 100 meters unless we had uh, thermals and so we uh, had thermal weapon sights a couple of us had thermal envgs because we were weren't told we could take them so i assumed it was okay um other than that you guys did a pretty good job protecting your flanks the problem was is that you were in the same situation as us you take fire and then you'd be staring into a thick soup of fog that you can't necessarily see from so your vehicles were more effective in that role today than uh, the infantry were. Uh, we generally were also on foot most of the time, so the reason why we kept attacking your rear was because, hey, uh, we're on foot. You can't really run fast. Someone kept driving quads around, and that's how I tracked you guys to your spawn. That's fine. That's the only way we could get around. Cause that's the only vehicle yeah. we had. And they fucking suck. Um, you hit a bush and get injured. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're... they're... Uh, if I can say just a couple words as well. Yep. One of the main yeah. things that you can do just individually, if you want to be a little bit better, and you'll notice what some of the high tiers do, one of the things what's that's taught. If you're ever walking somewhere, always feel free to sometimes hit the alt key and do a quick look around. Don't just keep staring ahead. Because one of the squads walked literally on top of me right on top of really the last guy in the squad was the only one to see me i was planning to sit there i only shot because he was looking straight at me yeah, yeah that was me the only reason i noticed you is because flipping i looked up from my phone because my steel <laughs> had and i look up and i see envg and i'm like oh that's not our guy yeah, two of two of the guys in your squad literally walked right on top of him and didn't yeah, notice. I'm I, like, I Jesus that, Christ! I, I turned around. I'm just like, oh, that's that that's not a good guy. That's a bad guy. <laughs> After yeah, that happened, we like... called. Go ahead. Yeah, that that just everyone. It's I mean, this is pretty simple. It's something I learned from what's that sniping lessons. It's pretty easy to just put your thumb on alt, swing your mouse around, mm -hmm. keep walking the way you're going. 
Uh, other than that, just the last thing I was going to say, towards the end, when the rear guard of the Madrid, or with the effort, was getting sniped, nice use of smoke obscure yourselves. Because you would smoke and you would back the people back up. Um, as well as hiding behind the vehicle. Because most sniper rounds we have won't go through the vehicles like that. Um, the only thing is, if you're getting sniped and you know hiding in the smoke is safe, don't then run out of the smoke and just stand still. It's better to just walk behind the house and either push on or pass your vehicles to do it. But I mean, other than that, pretty good using the smoke in the vehicle. Send in place. goat team We were just trying to locate you with the MG. We weren't really Look, sure as so we were shooting into the sub. I hope places you keep we thought you were up, so while you, uh, trying to. Got to kick out of this one. If just not, we'll have another op in an hour and 10, 20 minutes. You have to maintain the smoke. If you don't maintain the smoke, some kind of cover between yourself, such as a vehicle, or I guess in your case, fleshy bodies, um, you're going to get shot at. And so, in the case of using fleshy bodies, the fleshy bodies get shot. So, maintain the smoke because if we can't see where you're at, we can't shoot you. Um, you guys did a really good job there. Some people came in on a quillin, I engaged the quillin, uh, you start popping smoke, and then the smoke stopped, and I kept shooting them. Then I saw other targets because they popped more smoke. So uh, try to maintain the smoke. There's smoke grenades in vehicles. You can pull them out and use those if you need to. Like I think all vehicles should have smoke grenades. It might not be white smoke, but you can still use it. Um, other than that, you guys did a good job with your artillery today, kind of trying to harass the op four players. But really, just putting your artillery on only one point and using it only on that, the op four, not a great idea because that artillery is firing. A huge distance and so your dispersion on your rounds is going to be the larger the further out you go and so the further out it goes the less accurate it is and so when you're trying to make up for that with UXO pardon me with uh, clusters you get the secondary side effect of UXOs if you have to move into that area later on um, so what I'm trying to say is that we're just three guys we were four but we lost uh, somebody through and um, when you're taking a dedicated asset just to take out one guy like that it's not really the most effective use if it's if they're engaging your teams, yeah, take them out like with mechs and fucking prejudice. But if they're just like running from spawn, is that really the best use of your assets? Because we'll just respawn and then we'll throw on new kit. It's not that difficult for us to respawn guys. Um, so basically, it's like in order of threat magnitude. If something's really dangerous, kill it. If something's two kilometers away from your fucking guys, uh, why are you worrying about it? Just keep an eye on it. You can push left control plus T and you can track people with your drone. Uh, Caleb, you got anything? No. Anything else ruling? I can't think of anything else. No, I mean, it's... overall I think they handled this pretty well. Oh, yeah. Uh, the Cosman was actually very good about not hovering too much. There were a couple there times, times that ruling's like, I wish I had an AT stick. <laughs> Yeah, but like when when I was trying to line up, try to shoot the rotors or something, yeah, I couldn't get a shot. They kept rotating, I think, especially mm -hmm. after they got spooked by the first AA missile. To wrap it up real quick, um, just to state a few things. So again, I hope as he pushes up back to 7.30, uh, so that one's open to the public. Hope to see you guys in there. Um, second, I'm going to be doing a hot fix uh, this week on the Friday mod set. I'm going to be adding advanced towing, advanced um, sling loading, and backpack on chest for some future stuff uh, that would have been both with this uh, set of operations and another one I have planned to do after. And we'll see how that goes. If you have mod ideas, let me know. But things to note, I'm not adding any A stuff. I'm not anything adding anything that's super duper big unless it's the next map. So... Yeah. Um, Check on chest needs space. I, no. I was wrong. No, there's there's a certain one that doesn't. It's done by a oh, script. Okay. So cool. I'll be adding that one. So uh, up four, keep going. Open debrief. I'll be right back in a second. So, uh, and to the stream, um, I don't know what the other op is. It's Iopus's, is, but he told me it's going to be uh, interesting and a little crazy. So something exotic, I hope. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Go operate operationally. Shout out to Modedict for the freaking 150 gift subs. If you got a sub from him, make sure you thank him. All the resubs, appreciate it. Keeps me alive because I need money to eat and 
have electricity and a roof over my head. <laughs> Go operate operationally, guys. We'll be back for Iopus is up. Then Warcraft 3 at about 9.30. And uh, we'll see how it goes. So cheers, guys. Have a good one. And uh, yeah.